the Trojans got a bit of redemption on Tuesday night as they were able to ease the sting from an earlier loss this year to the Alabama State Hornets as the Trojans would coast to a 10-3 victory. I really did like tonight. Um, we got some guys back in the lineup that have started for us before, played a lot for us before, but got going in the season kind of slow. Been doing a lot of work on the side and in practice and finally got an opportunity to get them back in and I thought they played well. The Trojan offense scored 11 runs in the three game series against Middle Tennessee this past weekend, but belted out 10 runs in the victory over the Hornets. Danny Collins and Trey Santos led the Trojans offensively with three RBIs each and Logan Pierce pitched in an RBI as well. I'm just glad to you know help the team win off of last week's performance. It was a uh, Pretty bad on my part, didn't really do much to help, but uh, today glad I could uh, you know, score some runs and uh, get a few hits out of it, so I was really happy with it. Kind of frustrated with my last couple white bats, but other than that, you know, it works. We got a W. The Trojans saw a total of eight pitchers over eight innings of at-bats and fell as if the Hornets were just trying to disrupt a little bit of their offensive rhythm. But it is hard to hit when every time you come up, it's a new guy, you know, you never do get to really settle in, so I think we did a pretty good job handling that. These midweek games, they try to get a lot of arms in, uh, try to throw a lot of different guys at you, get you some different looks, maybe. Um, uh, but they did, and I thought they did a good job of mixing it up. Um, kind of threw us off a little bit, but you know we got in the groove. Justin McNally, Trojan Sports Now.